even a blind man can confirm that this is a very big scam that INEC has already showed to the whole world they are not competent to conduct the election. Now, find out most of the results they are bringing, the dates is, ab is about 23. They have already loaded the server. And the Mahmoud promised Nigerians that they, they will be transmitting directly to the server. Watch what is happening here now. It is now they are doing presidential election. You now see they are telling you this one has a fault, this one has a fault. So to me, if they don't do the right thing, they want to set the country into a very big problem. Every Nigerian is aware that the election was manipulated. But most of the results, over 90% of the results, were doctored in favor of a candidate who is not accepted by Nigerians. And everybody across the country, across the world, is aware that the election we just had was mostly manned by the youth of this country. And the youth knew who they wanted. And they knew who could serve them in a way that every Nigerian would have a sense of fulfillment. When we started this thing, we were all of us who were hungry. We were not happy. But from the day of election, from the day of election, when we were there, I personally supervised as an INEC observer. So as an INEC observer, I supervised election. Election was free and fair. There was no issues of uh, IJAC polling units, bylaws box, bylaws paper, voting uh, whatever. Everything was calm. To, to be honest, I am not happy because the way the things are going in Nigeria. Because me, I believe that this is the time of Igbo to rule. Yoruba has ruled. Hausa has ruled. Now is the time of Igbo to rule. They should give it to them. So if they know they are not going to give it to us, they should divide the country. This is a national shame and embarrassment. If you check people who are happy, it's about 5% out of 100. And they are close allied of Tinibu. I want to express my ill feelings. Is it, is it, does it mean that we cannot get things right once in Nigeria? The process of this election will be following it. And Mahmoud promised free and fair election. The President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Muhammad Buhari, promised free and fair election. In his words, he said, if I did not do anything for Nigeria, let me give Nigeria free and fair and credible elections. But now, the election process started. In various polling units in Nigeria today, there were no election at all. But the result has been uploaded already. Well, in a way, I accept that. You remember what happened in 2015 when oppositions teamed up against our beloved president, then Dr. Goodluck Jonathan, till today. And I, I don't know about the next 20, 30 years to come. Nobody has beaten his record. Has beaten his record. Yes, if the position had come up before now and teamed up as they did in 2015, definitely they would have been able to push off the, 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 the incumbent uh, government. But be that as may, everybody, in spite of that, we are all aware that, look, Nigerians know who won the election. Erufa is a ruler, he's not a leader, and everybody knows that they didn't perform. They only did there to loot money and park inside the warehouse and other things. Those, are you expecting somebody like Erufai or Ganduje to win election in free and fair election? No! Or to have you to has already conquered Lagos and tie Lagos, put inside his pocket. People are tired of all those can gambaru they are doing. We are tired of those things. What happened in Lagos is uh, he teach a Lagosian, the citizen of Lagos State, a kind of uh, because when you are welcome your visitor, you must give a kind of demarcation that there will be a day. That would be an issue for both of you. So, because we offer welcome, we offer pamper, we know what is what happened southwest, and we know what happened in southeast. Because there's a video claim that an annex officer was taking hand of an old woman in southeast to thumbprint on Labour Party. I witnessed that, and I have it. 
as an evidence. But we give glory to God Almighty because we are the winner, they are the loser. And we give grace, we give glory to God Almighty that gave us the grace. It's only the grace we have. Hunger and starvation that is in Nigeria can lead to anything. My advice to INEC is to do the needful by give the Nigerians exactly the persons we vote for. Bring them out. Don't be bringing a Babylon to come and govern Nigeria part two. Nobody will accept that. I was watching AIT this morning. Some people brought a resort from INEC server. AIT this morning. What did we saw there that they said they have uploaded? It's a face of a woman, not a resort. <laughs> it's in the public domain. AIT this morning. Let me tell you something. The promise that INEC gave, and according to the letter art, states that as you are voting, it is going straight to the INEC portal. But now, in some, in some cases, they were using manual, and that is where the league started. Because I've never seen any, any credible relation that come out of manual in a segmented country like Nigeria. So no state in Nigeria that we lose that we don't have above 25%. We give glory to Almighty Allah because we have the grace. It, to, it is the grace that we have that gave us the hedge above others. Because there are lots of uh, Ekibanki, Grimakai, and uh, enviousness. Because I was not expecting a former president of Nigeria, Olusa Gobasanjo, which means, as at yesterday, the press release in May yesterday shows where he belonged to. It's not in your mama. They have bastardized the judiciary. The present government have bastardized the judiciary. Uh, Supreme Court will give order, they don't obey it. Is it the court you are waiting to go for? What are you going to get there? You can't get any, any, any redress from that, such a, a court that has been bastardized. But that's the legal way to get justice. If you Let are me tell you, when, 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 when there is pure separation of powers in operation in a country, but when the executive has suppressed other arms of government, not to operate the way they should operate, they are reporting to the executive. Judicial is taking orders from the executive. House of Assembly is taking orders from the rubber stamp. So how can it work? It, it can work. All the dick and hurry, and we are going to establish that as from next week Monday. All the Odua nation, we are going to stage war against him in Abe Okuta. It's only his mother that's from Abe Okuta. His father is not from Abe Okuta. Do you understand me? We, we are going to stage a war against him. We, we respect him as an elderly person. But by him to hotter, because when he was in government, he conduct election for Yara, late Yara Dua. So even self, the election he conducted for late Yara Dua was not even better for uh, um, uh, President Muhammad Buhari. He's now called out President Muhammad Buhari to cancel the election that was free and fair. You get there are two things you will do to get a solution. There is carrot and there is stick. There is radicalism and there is dialogue. If you walk through dialogue, it didn't work. You use radicalism. Revolution has caused a lot of things. It has brought things that are supposed to be to come to reality. In most, most cases, revolution has been an answer. Dialogue also has been an answer. But revolution is when people are pushed to the world and they don't know what to do again. They result to self help eh? to bring the, the, the leaders accountable. And they are happy because the, the international organizations are watching. And you can have the, the you, can, you, can, you, you have seen the comments. You have had the comment of the international observers. All what we want is to let INEC do the needful. Unless the, the man himself, what I don't want to say anything, rather, if you put Nigeria into problem, you follow and suffer it. Let you do the needful by giving Nigerians, making give us real results. Almost of them are bringing us a fake result, they're bringing out. It's a fake result.